some breakfast choices. We came down, they just had like the cereal and the juice and the coffee and we thought, oh, is this it? You get to choose anything from this menu when you stay in the rooms. But we'll come to Scotland and stay, it's great. Yeah. Breakfast, it's included, it's awesome. Yeah, because it's a good breakfast. Yummy, yummy. Second full Scottish breakfast. We are here at uh, Nicole and David's, um, but they are currently helping Nicole's mom move house. This is a friends of friends and some of our best memories so far from this trip of when we're able to be in someone's home. Touring different sceneries and all that is really wonderful, but for us, we love relationships, and so that's more meaningful uh, for us. <laughs> so we're just having dinner at Nicole and David's, and um, this hot dog pizza is actually quite good. So thanks for the recommendation, Nicole. You are so welcome. We're pretty much just getting work done. Last night we played some games. The girls won. Woo! -hoo! Woo -hoo! Technically, but hey, you won. And then this morning, Peter made some French toast, and it was just fun to see the different ways of French toast. Uh, ketchup is a big thing, so they put ketchup on their French toast. So it's just fun. The different cultures, and I've been enjoying that. I love Aldi. Aldi's amazing. Aldi. I said it wrong. <laughs> Aldi. Aldi. Uh, Aldi. Not Aldi. <laughs> nah, I think it's so much better to stay with families because then you're making friends along the way instead of being like a stranger or a tourist just passing through. You know, it's so much more fun. Okay, so Nicole got us some Iron Brew. And apparently it's more important in Scotland, especially in Glasgow area, <laughs> than kilts, um, than bagpipes. bagpipes, everything Scottish. This is the drink. Because apparently it's too caffeinated, so we didn't want a lot. It's good. <laughs> it tastes like a soda, though. Exactly. <laughs> oh, that is good. <laughs> nice. I like it. Mm -hmm. It's like a creamy soda. Really creamy cream soda. I like it. Right now, I still feel like I'm in my comfort zone being here in the UK. Everyone's still speaking the same language. There's not too much of a cultural difference. Uh, and then we're gonna go to Ireland next. And then after that, the rest of Europe, then I'll start to see the cultural differences more. And then maybe I'll be out of my comfort zone. But for right now, it's been great. <laughs> oh, you're excited. He was whining earlier. It's 1.30 and normally John doesn't take a walk until 5 or 6, but with us being here, he's just like, hey, you don't have to pay attention to me. Oh, yeah. So he's excited. Have a good walk. It's time for some comfort food. My mom absolutely hates SpaghettiOs, so we could never have SpaghettiOs growing up. I just really like SpaghettiOs whenever I get the chance. It's a nice treat. And it was only 15 pence for one can. It's great. The tomato base tastes, tastes a little bit different. Um, it tastes like the breakfast beans. It tastes like that kind of tomato sauce. You playing? <laughs> we are walking to the train depot to be picked up by Nicole because it's just faster for her to stop there and then we'll finally go and get to meet Josephine. <laughs> Holy cow! It makes it look so good. Thank you so much. Thank you. So I'm taking a video. How's ice cream? Delicious. Delicious. Good. Yeah. I do pictures. <laughs> you don't do pictures? Well, good thing I'm just doing a video. Uh, yeah, great. <laughs> <laughs> this is the River Clyde here in Scotland. And we are just taking Joe's dog for a walk more really good ham. We could finish it out in three rounds. We're flying out tomorrow from Glasgow to Dublin and it's the first time that we're using Ryanair. I'm taking lots of extra precautions. Peter, his bag's fine. So small, so tiny. So small. You know, it's like 20 something pounds in there. Mind, I have to maneuver it in such a way that it won't look bulky. I am wearing all of these clothes tomorrow. <laughs> I'm wearing my jeans with short sleeves. 
um, the the pink sweater I have on now and my uh, rain jacket and my puff jacket. So my bag should not be puffing out at all. Uh, I'm about to pack it up to, to see.